Welcome, I'm from the Samsung Galaxy A52s and today I will show you how to record your screen on this device. So get started, pull down your notification panel and look for the screen recording toggle, which for me is right here in the corner. So once you find it, you can simply tap on it. It will ask you for access to things like uh, uh, screen capture. So you want to allow that uh, to microphones. Again, you want to allow that to storage. Again, you want to allow that to microphone, obviously, so it can record uh, either the sound that the phone makes or you. Uh, screen capture just so you can see the screen and store it so it has the place to store it somewhere. So basically allow all of those. If as an example you don't allow storage, uh, this will not work at all. Uh, if you don't allow microphone or uh, screen capture, then I think screen capture will make it not function correctly. Uh, without sound or microphone, you just won't have any kind of sound on your recording. But anyway, once you enable all of those, uh, you will see this page right over here. So sound settings, this is right before you start recording. It asks you if you want to record media sounds, media sounds and microphone or no sound. Now, for some reason, there is no option for just mic. Uh, that's unfortunate. Um, but anyway, select whichever one you want. With a caveat, if you're going with the uh, media and mic, do use headphones with, uh, when doing so, because when you're recording two different sound sources, so uh, phone and microphone, the phone sound is basically being recorded in a system. Uh, it's not re being recorded through the uh, output of the microphone, it's being internally recorded. So when the phone records internally and then makes that sound through the micro uh, through the speaker the microphone will pick that sound up again so you'll have this kind of like echo effect on your recording which isn't necessarily desirable so that's why i'm saying use headphones with this but anyway uh, i'm gonna stick with just the media sound which does not include microphone and i'm gonna select start recording which will do a countdown from three and then start recording so obviously whatever I'll do right now will be recorded by the device. Um, additionally, you can interact with toggles right here so we can draw on our recording. Uh, I can go back, as you can see. You can pause the video. Uh, this is a nice feature if you, for instance, launching an application and that application launches for a little bit too long. You can pause the video when it's being launched and then resume it once it launches. So just say, just turn this off. So let's say I want to open up Game Launcher, so I agree here, and I just keep it like this. And now I can resume a recording. And once I'm done recording, I can click on that square right here, which will automatically save the video recording. Now this will save it with this kind of like cut, so going from the home screen to straight to the app without actually being able to see me opening it up. But you will be able to see on the recording right here. Now as you can see there was the cut, so when I paused and launched the application so anyway, this is how you record a screen on this device and if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.